Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to create a sign-in, sign-out sheet to use in Google Forms. This is something I'm doing in my classroom this fall, and I thought I'd share it with you as well. So let's start here in Google Forms. I'm gonna create a new form, and I'm just gonna call it my Room 239 Sign-In Sign-Out. By the way, that actually is my room number. Now, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to change the settings. I don't require students to enter their email addresses, but you could collect email addresses for this if you wanted to. Instead, I just make my first question your name, and obviously it'd be a short answer, and that's required. Now, the next question, where are you going? And I'll make that multiple choice. I have a few options in here for bathroom, main office, guidance office, library, or other. And that other students can fill in themselves and again, required. Now the next question I put in here, I'm going to say time you left and I'll make that a time question. And I can leave it required. Now you might turn that off, but I'm gonna leave that required. And time you returned. And again, that's gonna to default to time and I'm gonna leave it as required. Now, the next thing I'm going to do, I'm gonna hit that send button and get my link for it. I'm gonna put that link in my Google Classroom under classwork. I have it listed as a material as my sign out sign in sheet. And I tell students complete this form when you leave the classroom. And now I'm going to put that link in there. And that's just a topic that I have under classroom logistics. And I'll post it. Now, when my students go to leave class, they open up that form and they fill out the time they left. And when they return and they leave it open, they lock their computers, but they leave the form open. When they return, they turn in the time that they return. So I'll show you the student perspective of that right now. So here's my student Mason in the class and he needs to leave to go to the restroom. So he's gonna go here to classroom logistics, hit that sign in sign out sheet, put in his name, his name Mason, go to the restroom and he's gonna leave at, let's say it's 4.15 p.m. Now he leaves the class, he locks his computer, leaves the class, and when he returns, he fills in the time that he came back and submit it. Now, there is another way you might consider doing this. You might consider leaving the form as not required on the times and that way your students could go ahead and fill out the time they left. Then when they return, fill out the form again with just the return time. So it would look like this. Bring that up again. So the student would click it this way. Mason goes to the restroom, leaves at 4.15, PM and hit submit. Now, when he returns, submits another response, fills that in and fills in the time that he returned and submits it. So it'll be two entries for every time they leave and return to the classroom using that method, as opposed to the previous method 
where they just have one submission for every time they leave and come back to the classroom. So that's how you can have a digital sign-in, sign-out sheet for your classroom in Google Classroom. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.